this is Scott, and this is the Hyper Report. Here are the quotes for various items. First, Chinese trade crashes. It appears that global trade is grinding to a halt, and in dollar-denominated cases, it has even gone into reverse. Chinese July exports have crashed 8.3% year-over-year and are down 3.6% from the month before. It wasn't just exports, imports have also tumbled by 8.1%. With exports dropping, a Chinese QE is now inevitable. Next, labor force. A record of nearly 93.8 million people 16 and older were neither employed in July nor made any specific efforts to find work in the prior four weeks according to the latest fictional jobs report. With that in mind, we are supposed to believe that the unemployment rate is steady at 5.3%? Next, medical records not safe. The use of administrative subpoenas is a direct violation of the Fourth Amendment, but few privacy advocate groups have focused on the issue until recently. Now, a federal judge has ruled that the DEA and other government agencies are allowed to, on a regular basis, gain warrantless and judgeless access to medical and other personal records. Next, facts on college bubble. Here are a few facts about the impending college bubble collapse. 1. 90% of student loans are government backed. 2. A third of new graduates are delinquent in paying back college loans. 3. Students on average have $30,000 in debt excluding other debts like credit cards and private money. Next, Obama's voter ID lie. Obama not only believes that photo ID to vote is wrong, he also says that people voting for another person doesn't happen. Next thing you know, he'll say that people don't vote multiple times like Democratic staffers encouraged. It would seem that Obama is incapable of ever telling the truth about anything. Next, EPA environmental crimes. The Environmental Protection Agency is warning residents to keep away from a river in Colorado after spilling mine waste water into it and turning the river orange. Of course, it goes without saying that none of the communist slime balls at the EPA will be financially or criminally held responsible for this crime. Next, digital carjacking. Please take a look at this video showing how a car can be digitally carjacked. Finally, please prepare now for the escalating economic and social unrest. Good day.